already we have discussed on the topic of composite materials on our online lecture series i am dr rajit pawar from snd college of engineering and a research center yola today's topic is the composite materials and in which our process is running with the polymer matrix composites in last lecture now in polymer matrix composites the reinforcement fibers roving woven fabrics non woven random mats are discussed turn to first topic reinforcement fibers fiber reinforcement in a polymer matrix is an effective method of developing tribologically significant composites the reinforcement for composites can be fibers fabric particles or viscous reinforcement fibers are either natural fibers animal minerals cellulose fibers or synthetic man made fibers in the man made fibers which is glass carbon polymers here the focus is on man made glass fibers which are the overall dominating fibers used for large cost structure such as wind turbine rotor blades also the fibers is especially characteristic by one very long axis with other axis either open circular or near circular particles have no prefer orientation and so does their shape viscous have prefer shape but are small both in diameter and length compared to the fiber now there are various types of the fiber reinforcement carbon fibers fiber glass or glass fibers aramid fibers to strand in bobbins tap in roll one fabrics in rolls then post mats and repex classification in this classification then post made it divided in various types just we discuss in uh, further fibers tilled viscous flex particular and directionally solidified eutectics then field is classified into further two types particle field and microsphere and microsphere is further subdivided into solid and hollow hollow solid then some classification of reinforcement fiber is based on the orientation of fibers there are four types first is unidirectional second one is bidirectional third one is discontinuous fibers and last one is a woven these four types are on basis of the fiber orientation first unidirectional unidirectional carbon fiber fabrics is a type of carbon reinforcement that is non woven and features all fibers running in a single parallel direction with this style of fabrics there are no gap between fibers and those fibers lay flat see here there are figures showing the structure of unidirectional fibers unidirectional carbon fibers is show in the right side and left side shows the x and y axis how the direction of the fibers next one is a bidirectional for bidirectional fibers composites ultimate strength is low but occurs in two unique direction since the direction of fiber turn out more statistically diversified so out the composite decreased in ultimate strength whether a property are consistent in all the 
strategical direction of the fibers see here in the figure in the bidirectional there are two direction ek horizontal one is the horizontal another is the uh, vertical and both are connected to each other in the bidirectional fibers next one is a discontinuous fibers discontinuous in the discontinuous fibers it is less effective in strengthening the materials however their composite <coughs> modulus and tensile strength can be approached 50 to 90 percentage of their continuous and aligned counterparts and they are cheaper faster and easier to fabricate into complicated shape here two diagrams are described one is a discontinuous fibers viscous are show in the left side and second one is a structure of the discontinuous fiber this fibers is discontinuous which is in random directions it is not fixed direction next one is a one one fiber is made by combining three plant fiber together plant fiber can be found all over the map in grounded as a tiny green plants you can also find it when chopping down grass if you have just started playing there there is no need to venture to far from the opening area see here in the one there are two diagram one is in all the vertical and horizontal direction are attached to each other see in the bidirectional bidirectional in the bidirectional is similar in some parts in the over fiber the next one is the roofing it is a simplest and most common form of glass fiber a roofing is a long and narrow bundle of fibers roofing is produced during the process of making spun yarn from wool piece raw cotton or other fibers their main use is an fiber prepared for spinning but they may also be used specified specialized kinds of knitting or other textile arts see the diagram the diagram shows the just like a roller in some small shops this uh, cotton of the this tag is used in rolling type for binding something the rolling is simplest and most common form of the glass fibers is rolled now turn to next woven fabrics woven fabrics are made on looms in variety of weight wears and width one are bidirectional providing good strength in the direction of yarn and they facilitate fast composite fabrication broadcloth denim drills poplin cotton lawn cardio are the some examples of this woven fabrics they are show in the figure then woven fabrics shawls are in the left side and then the structure of woven fabrics are shown in the right side of the figure now the non woven random mats non woven fabrics is a fabric like material made from staple fiber and long fibers staple means short types and long means the continuous long bonded together by chemical mechanical 
non-woven fabrics are extensively used in the manufacture of both single use and durable clothing notable market segments being protective clothing garments linen interlining wedding shoe linen and synthetic leather fabrics in the non woven type chopped mat certain randomly distributed fiber cut to length typically ranging from 38 mm to 63.5 mm per 1.5 to 2.5 inch continuous strand mat is formed from wheels of continuous fiber strand there are the diagram shows for the non woven fibers matrix of the random mats there are left side diagram show the structure and right side are used just like a pad in our houses to for the use of the housekeeping purpose thanks